Hello everyone, welcome to another one of my one-shot gameplays. This is called The Lady in Black. And we've got a small warning screen, we better read this one first. This game was created by a one-man developer team. Team? A one-man? Which was myself. Prior to making this short video game, I had no experience with code or scripting, so this was all new to me. Due to that, the game did not come out exactly how I wanted it to come out. It never does. As a game developer myself, I understand exactly what you mean and different screen resolutions will cause the main menu buttons to be weird sizes. Sorry. Hm. However, with that being said, I hope you still enjoy the game I created for everyone. Smiley face. And please read the controls before playing. Ah, oh, that's nice. It's about the people who are playing it. Oof. Okay, controls. Last function, fix flickering flashlight, F, run is the left shift, shift open doors, E, it's uh, pretty much the standard controls. Alright. Come and play. <laughs> Deep in some parts of the woods lies an abandoned house where a family of five once murdered. No one knows how or why this happened, and still remains a mystery to this very day. Although it is said that some kind of ghost killed them. Many people have tried to figure out what just happened. Whatever. Whoa! Hold on. Your name is Alex, a paranormal investigator. You have gone to the house to find out what is really happening out there. You enter the house and everything seems to be fine until something goes terribly wrong. You wake up what seems to be hours later in an unknown place, and you are now trapped in her game. Find the keys to do the front door to escape, but don't let her catch you, sounds easy, can you escape? Oh. Interesting crosshair. I haven't seen a crosshair like that since Elite. Okay. And we got a broken toilet. Sorry. Okay, bathtub. It's raining heavily. What have we got here? Ah, a key. Oh. I can't pick it up. Oh, now I've got it. You obtain the key. Mouse controls aren't very sensitive. Can I pick that up? Oh, got it, yep, okay. A note. Don't look at her, you must not. Okay, why have I got this feeling if I turn around? Okay, we're good. Alright. Oh, it stopped raining now. I gotta get into the habit of using the WASD keys, because I'm always using the arrow keys. Door's locked. Why? Please no jump scare. Okay. Is that me doing that creaky noise? It is me, okay. That's alright then. Of course it's not alright. I'm not running. I'm not running for anyone. Oh, flicking flashlight. Okay. Don't look at her. Ah, this is creepy. Ugh. Standard Unity flashlight, by the way. Okay, another note. Be nice. You will die if she gets close to you, or you get close to her. Who's writing these notes? Whoa, that's an old style TV. Hello. And this is... That looks like a cover for a fireplace. Or Oh, it's a chair. Okay, fine. 
Oh, another key. Get the key. Get the key, get the key, get the key. We'll pick it up. Strange. Why can't I pick up the key? Ah, okay. I seem to have an issue with trying to pick up the keys. I think it's like a pixel perfect mesh collider or something that I have to get it over with. Alright. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Ooh. Oh, I'm scared by a wall. <sighs> Loud music. This game's gonna scare me, I know it. Squeak. Another bathroom? Oh, f flashlight. I was gonna say flashlight, didn't say anything else. Another key. Alright, pixel perfect. Clicking. Why is it so difficult to pick up keys? Come on. Pick up the key. Hooray! Okay, this uh, lady in black appears to be half cloak, half skeleton. really being cautious about looking around here. Empty fridge. Hmm. <sighs> you always want you. When I hear the squeak, I think, she's behind me. And just turn around slowly. <laughs> she goes away after a while if you don't look at her. Well, that's contrary to some games that I've seen. There's a game called, uh... <laughs> okay... Okay... Nothing in the oven? Is she in here? No, okay. Okay. I don't think I've missed anything. That's, that's pretty much it in here, I think. No key in the sink or something, is there? No, I don't think so. Anyway, yes, as I was saying, uh, there's a game called uh, SCP Containment Breach, and that involves SCP-173, I think his name is. Just basically a giant concrete gingerbread man with spray paint on his face, and you've got to always look at him, otherwise he'll kill you. So this is clearly the opposite, and... I have no idea where I'm going to go now. Oh, what am I missing? Is the door open now? No. I've got to go back upstairs. This is running, by the way. I'm actually running. <laughs> I really don't like that. <laughs> ah! Okay, don't look. Why have I got a feeling that I'm going to be doomed from the start? Ah, flickering light. Fix. Okay. No, nothing. Back in the bathroom. Broken bathroom. Okay, one of these doors has now been rendered open. I just know it's which one is in there. Just a little note there, you notice that. 
Those are two textures trying to fight each other to get dominance over the other one. That is quite annoying. It's... ooh. Okay. The dreaded music box. Is she behind me? No, but there is a key. Clearly the baby's room. Can I switch that off? No, but I can open the drawers. Ah. No, nothing in there. Oh, it's just that drawer I can open. Oh no, another key. Okay, I think I'm opening the door. Yes, I am. Oh, it's so hard to pick up keys. No, don't open the door! Come on, pick up the key. Flashlight! Why can't I pick up the key? Come on! Is it just a picture? Is it, is it really a real key? It looks like a real key. I didn't constantly open and... Pick up the key! Hooray! Okay. Let's just look what's inside these before I go. Yeah, I'll just... Right. Where is she? God, I was half expecting it. <sighs> okay, uh, I didn't save it. I don't know if you can. If you can, I'll I'll replay this and uh, we'll resume from where we left off. Okay, everyone, we're resuming from this position now, and I have to apologise. It turns out that. I don't press E to pick up the keys, I press the left mouse button, which is interesting because everything else I've been doing so far I've been pressing E, and for keys I press the left mouse button to pick up. Now, I've also discovered that I think, obviously when I look directly at her, she comes slowly towards me and touches me and kills me. So behind this door when she appears, all I have to do is just turn around sharply or just look down. So that's my plan, I'm going to be very quick about this. Alright, let's get the key. Okay, she didn't appear that time, unless she's right behind me. Let's just look slowly. Okay, right. Ah, okay, resuming from where we left off. There is no save function, so at least I assume there isn't. No, there is not. There is no save function, which means I'm going to have to be a bit more careful, otherwise I'm going to have to resume all over again from the beginning. Right. Careful. Okay. Gosh, you scared the living daylights out of me when she just appeared like that. <laughs> okay, don't look. Pick up the key. God, oh, it's so nerving. The fact that I can't really move very fast either. And I have to turn really carefully because that massive scream obviously appears when she touches you. In the meantime it's just giggle giggle giggle. So many doors. Which are so close but so far. I bet that's the last door I'm going to have to go through.
Dạ ạ Ok, she poofed Oh Careful I really have to be careful every time I look around the corner or look behind me now because she may be right behind me just waiting for me to look directly at her I can only hope that she doesn't suddenly poof in front of me If I gotta go downstairs, I gotta go downstairs Downstairs next to this green bit of slime <laughs> Oh shit! Oh. I'm sorry fellow viewers for that uh, sudden outburst that's, uh, that's the first time that's ever happened Okay Oh, a short jump scare. <laughs> oh dear. I almost put the headphones off my head then. Oh boy. Another one. I mean, as a fellow game developer, I know how all this is made. I know all these trigger points and all these activation codes that you're doing every time I pick up a key. Right, where is she? most of the time. <laughs> ah, okay. How many doors can there be? Uh, am I going to go upstairs now? I bet I'm going to go upstairs. Okay, look down. It's the sound that jumps me. It's not the actual sight of her. It's the sound of the, the scream. I'm on edge now. This is not fair. game I've played yet. Ah, not that one. I'll oh, don't start now. Okay. Oh, careful. Don't appear. Ah! Oh no, don't tell me it's downstairs. Yeah, I thought so. I thought maybe you appear there. I'll just look at this corner for a bit. It takes her about five or six seconds to vanish. I'm pretty sure this wasn't highlighting red last time I saw it. Okay! Why am I going to get the shock of my life if I go in there? Ugh. It's not nice. Okay. Dolls everywhere. Pretty freaky dolls which I think are looking at me! Yeah, I know how that's done as well. <laughs> and knowing how it's done does not help. <laughs> Another key. I am really trying to squeeze into my chair here. <laughs> this is not fair. This is horrible. Ah! God, I'm glad these things can't kill me. Okay. That was freaky enough. Okay, I'm going to look at the wall.
were overdue for a really loud scream. Oh, that's definitely the last door. Okay. Okay, I'm going to look down at this bit. Yeah, I know I'm looking down a lot, I'm sorry, but I just can't handle one of those screams again, but it's going to happen. Oh, I actually closed my eyes for that bit. <laughs> this is this game's really good. It is it's keeping me on edge here. Uh, the jump scares are a bit annoying, but apart from that, the atmosphere is quite intense. Was that it? Shouldn't there be a key or something? Maybe I missed it. No, I can't do anything but the draw. Nope. Oh. Hmm. Ah, there it is. Key obtained, and now we're going to creep over... Careful. Please tell me now I've got enough. Oh boy! Fellow gamers, you are warned. Look away now. I know it. It's going to come. Okay, uh, okay, uh, focus now. <laughs> May 13th, 1995. Why is she trying to kill us all? Help. Flashlight, come on, why are you doing this to me? Right. Is there a key in here as well or Ah, here we go. Another one? Oh this must be for the for the front door, it has to be. <laughs> okay. Can we... I'll just stay here for a few seconds. This video is going to get quite long. I may have to split it into two. Careful. This. Oh, that was close. Uh, yeah, it has to be for the front door. She's appearing way too often. Let me out. Oh no! Come on!
Okay, I finally found the door that it opens to. That took me a while. I thought there was a key there. Oh, there she is. Hmm? Hmm. Okay. That's that's gross. Key in the bathroom? Yep, there it is. There is lots of keys in this game. It seems to be mainly key focused. Yes, let's all focus on the key issue. Okay, another door. If this takes ages, I may have to cut through this one as well. I'm waiting for it to scare me. I doubt I've got the key to the front door. There's one door up here that hasn't been opened yet. Wait for it. There we go. There's another key. Uh, too many... Oh, two keys. Oh, dear. But Funny enough, that didn't scare me. Ironic. Choose wisely. Uh-oh, yes. Okay, now, I'm left-handed, viewers, so I'm going to go with the left key. Escape to the front. Okay, here we go. I took the left key. Ah! If by chance I took the wrong key, I will of course replay it and show you the alternative ending. If not, then I'll just call it quits and class it as a success. Ah! I've got to be really cautious now because she's going to appear everywhere. Scream? Any scream? Ooh. Okay, guy, uh, of course you're going to appear there. Choose wisely, what's going to happen? Okay, here we go, viewers. Okay, the outside world. Oh, I made it! Hooray! Victory! I chose well! Yes! Urgh, yes! Alright, this is more like it. And my phone's going off. Not at this moment, I'm not. Okay. <sighs> that was good. Oh, it's a button I can't click. Okay, well, yes. Oh, that was good. Well, that was absolutely brilliant, and I'm not going to find out what happens if I pick the other key. If you want to pick the other key, the download link for this game is in the description, so you can find out yourself. Clearly, being left-handed has worked out pretty well for me. Overall, I'm going to say that game was very, very good. It was quite intense, a little heavily based though on the uh, keys and doors issue, but then again, uh, considering that he's not a very good programmer, I'd say he, he, he did very well. He was very good. Lots of uh, tense moments there. I was on my guard pretty much the entire time. Very simple concept as well. It was very good. I was very pleased to play that. If he makes another one, Lady in White or something, then I'll be playing that as well. So, Anyway, if you've enjoyed this video, like it and subscribe. And stay tuned for any more videos that I'll produce. Keep playing. I'll see you soon.